It's called Wirecast. It is a home studio that fits on your laptop and will give you what you're seeing right now with me. Let me introduce Tom Prain. It's kind of hard for somebody to wrap their head around it. What Wirecast is, is a whole production studio, but it's software driven. And right. with that, you can make a full on TV show such as exactly what you and I are looking at each other that way right now. Right. There's all the, all the components you would need to, to set up a show, whether they're kind of lower thirds, the titling, the uh, green screen. We could put a green, I could put a green screen behind me and put other pictures and, you know, a virtual studio on if I wanted to. Uh, I can bring in IP cameras. I can really have unlimited uh, HD cameras connected. Uh, as long as I have the hardware, the, the computer, and in this case, I have a Mac Pro, uh, a new Mac Pro, so it has tons of power in it. Uh, you can you can stream literally half a dozen cameras. We have a new iOS app that we'll talk about that uh, I could put six or eight of those uh, into the stream as well. So it's it's a lot of fun. And Tom, the lower third that we see now sweeping off the screen, a new addition to Wirecast. Uh, you guys having taken it to the next level, which is why not have proper professional graphics in your proper professional look? Uh, yeah, we, we've added uh, uh, something called New Blue Titler Pro. Uh, that's a, a very uh, powerful titling and 3D animation uh, tool that's built into Wirecast Pro. Uh, and there's all types of things you can do through animating, as you just did with that lower third, uh, making things explode and run across the screen, diagonally, you know, whatever you like. Uh, it's, it's like uh, uh, more sophisticated graphics software, but uh, at a very cheap price and built into uh, to Wirecast. Wirecast 6 now includes new features that allow you to add more powerful production capabilities to your broadcast. With the new playlist feature, you can queue a list of multiple videos, images, audio, or live shots to play in sequence. Great for adding commercial breaks, streaming archived content during off hours, or rotating between live camera views. Automating your broadcast workflow between media and live shots is now possible. A separate playlist window lets you easily create playlists and see what's scheduled. Drag and drop new content, trim and edit recorded video, and set what happens upon completion of the playlist. Return to your last shot, loop content, hold your last shot, or display current preview window. Wirecast 6 also introduces a new replay feature. Of course great for sporting events, but also to replay a portion of any live show. During your show, simply click the replay button to capture a clip and add it to the master layer. When replaying, you can slow down, speed up, or scrub across the entire clip to find the perfect moment. Combine your replay clips with the playlist feature to create your own on-the-fly highlight reels. You can now easily trim and edit your recorded media, including replays, from the new preview window. With any piece of media, you can custom configure its length and set in and out points. Just zoom in on the timeline for more precise editing. With brand new playlist, replay, and on-the-fly editing features, Wirecast 6 allows you to add more powerful production capabilities to your broadcast. Now, one of my new favorites, of course, is instant replay. So let's say we're video streaming a sporting event or something of that nature, and uh, we want to show that again. Or we're doing a presentation for a company. I can back it up and replay it live in real time. That's right. You can choose any segment of your uh, of your broadcast one of the things that we do instead of you know some applications may might do a, a 30 second cache and throw it away 30 seconds throw it away we literally you could uh, record the entire stream you can take bits and pieces of it you can take uh, you can configure uh, how long your your replay segment will be how short it'll be uh, and it, it's very easy to set up you can utilize it in sports. Um, I've talked to doctors who've used it for, for ultrasound uh, diagnosis, long distance, uh, many, many different things you can do with it. Can we demonstrate something, Tom, uh, from your studio where you guys are right now? Show us uh, some of the bells and whistles like social media, for instance. We can have live Twitter feeds. Yes, you can run live Twitter feeds. Uh, you can set up your Twitter account and authenticate to that uh, that account, you can run your your home timeline. You can run uh, 
searches on hashtags, for example, uh, and run those into your feed. You do get the opportunity, you get a, a window to look at to, so that you can choose the, the tweets uh, that you want to push live. Uh, inevitably, you're not going to want to push everything live. You're uh, going to want to pick and choose uh, what looks good or, or what looks relevant for a particular show. Yes, we can, uh, we can show Twitter feed, uh, feeds uh, into Wirecast. Uh, you can set it up so that you can show your, your home timeline, uh, other, other types of feeds. You can search on hashtags, for example, so that you show... Uh, Within the uh, application. Yes. You could, if you're having a special event, you might have a hashtag, you know, hashtag Carrie, Carrie Harrison show. Uh, and then you can, uh, you can follow that in your feed and you can push those up on the screen. You have the chance to edit it so that you, you don't have to push every tweet into the, into the feed. And it really rotates at a time, one tweet, two tweets, three tweets, and then might roll over again to number one. Uh, but it does offer you that, that option to interact with your audience uh, like, you, like you've never really been able to do before. So here's what's interesting, Tom, and just for the sake of transparency, um, right now, all of this, all of this that we can see is Wirecast driven. I am sitting in a, well, I just don't want to admit what it really <laughs> looks like, but this is available to everybody else at the same time. All they need is a green screen or a blue screen, and they can be as fancy as the imagination will allow, I'm guessing. Oh, yeah. There's virtual sets that are built into Wirecast. There's also third-party vendors where you can purchase some virtual sets from. Uh, uh, you can create your own graphics and sets if you want to, if you're really good with Photoshop or other applications. Uh, and you can bring all of those into Wirecast. So it, it's, uh, it's really powerful, and it creates professional-looking broadcasts uh, and uh, really engaging. You're able to keep, keep the, the viewer interested with, with something more than my, uh, my home studio here <laughs> with, the, with the egg cartons on the wall. But. Well, you know, interestingly, I discovered you guys uh, for obviously the video streaming that we're doing right now. But at the time um, for my public radio show, um, I realized that yours was the only app, unlike Skype, unlike all the rest that just do a sort of a thin mixed mono feed, you send out, you transmit, you could do, you can go live on YouTube, for instance, on your own YouTube channel, but you guys do it in full bandwidth stereophonic sound. This was extraordinary to me. I went to Canada and I was doing live radio shows through your TV software. I mean, I'm sure you never imagined that, but you guys allowed me to do FM remotely without paying for ISDN lines, all that installation, the engineers. It would have been seven to ten thousand dollars per remote that I was doing for free once yeah. I had your software. Yeah, it's uh, it's it's pretty surprising the, the the breadth of what you can do. You know, the uh, Wirecast is developed by a company, my company called Telestream. And our DNA is really about encoding and streaming uh, uh, bits and bytes. So uh, it's the, all of that great technology that's used at, at a very uh, high broadcast level. Uh, and our, you know, our major customers are all the, the broadcast companies you can imagine worldwide. That kind of technology that's in those applications is also brought into Wirecast. So that's what gives you that, that nice uh, uh, power to be able to do things, whether it's an FM radio show or whether it's a, a live stream. So using an iPhone as an external camera, I'm holding my iPhone right here. I'm just going to show how it works. You can see it here. This is the app. It actually shows me there's a red button right here. I'm going to push the red button. I am now pushing it. And we're going to cut to uh, my iPad here. And you can see we're panning. Around. This is what the room really looks like. <laughs> it's a radio studio, <laughs> all masked with with a dust cover, uh, right. all masked by Wirecast. We have a little green screen here in the background, uh -huh. um, you know, and all of this going on here. But it's an external camera, as you could see. So we ignore shoot. The man, ignore the man behind the curtain. And ignore the man behind the curtain, and then we could just shoot my computer screen, and we could see all of that there. So that 
is the external high def camera. How cool is that? It's. Uh, it, I think people will fun, have a lot of fun with it. Uh, as I said, when we we tested the app, we we put eight or ten in one row of shots, so you can have people literally walking around from different perspectives, uh, getting different shots of of the event. Well, I am thrilled by this, and I think we should right now. Uh, even though I just fucked up that shot because your graphic is in there. So we were on you. We're going to cut to me. I like that. So let's have a nice demonstration of all the bells and whistles of Wirecast. Uh, we're going to roll a video that really shows this thing in its full gorgeousness. Boom, cut to video. We'll come back and thank you. Okay. Tom Prane, I want to thank you so much for joining us today and explaining why this is truly the single greatest piece of television software ever developed by the human mind. Well, thanks for your enthusiasm. <laughs> it, it is. Uh, it, it's great. I, I think it's just so surprising when broadcasters themselves see it doesn't cost tens or hundreds of thousands of dollars to do a professional looking high value uh, broadcast. It, Wirecast will do it.